We are broadcasting live from the Thunderdome in Center Amplis, Forsk, Minnesota. And the Mutant Eaters have a proud history in the MFL of winning just about everything but the really big game that matters. And maybe that's why they have the same exact number of bars and churches. Hey, shut up and pass the tater tots, huh? Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Lost Wages Invaders take on the Purple Mutant Eaters. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? It's time to turn on, tune in, and get your mutant buzz on. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here. It's MFL game day, and you know what that means. Yeah, the town will be in flames tonight, and half the city's population will be sliding down greased street poles and eating all-you-can-eat horse buffets from the curb. Yes, victory can be bittersweet sometimes, Bricks. Let's see if the home team can light up this town like a Roman candle. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Third down and tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic personality. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. Yeah, an eight ball wouldn't hurt either. Did somebody say cocaine? And it's first and ten. <gasps> and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the changes, Gord, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. Oh. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. I don't know which First and ten. Second down and a lot. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. First and ten. Hot one. Hot. It looks like the lineman wanted to give the ball a high five. That he did, Bricks. That he did. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Oh, 
Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Gives up five yards there. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. First down and six. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And that'll bring up second and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. You gotta be fucking kidding me. If that's a penalty, they should come up here and penalize those too. Hey, don't get these bets any ideas, you idiot. Friend, I just dash. On it. Second down and more. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down in a mile. Third down and never going to happen. Right rage ignites that deep down violent rage and makes you unstoppable. I'll take it. And like Rex's bowels, he is loose and headed for the end zone. He could go all the way. And he scores. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Friends. Their marketing team hates it. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. Hot. Hot 
one, hot two, hot. I personally think that the ginormous guy is compensating for something. Oh, he took a leap and hit the ball, knocked out. Fumble. He's got a case of fumbleitis. He's at the 10. It's a touchdown. <laughs> Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. It's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And they just smacked that one back in his face. Second down and ten. Hot, hot. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. Third down and ten. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Third down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what... Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a conference at home. And it's first and ten. <laughs> oh, with a brutal hit. That'll be second down and four. First down! And this guy is a stud, Bricks. They're telling me! Nice run! No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down and five. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And 
it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. And Chainsaw's really oh. sending the red zone. Oh. He's at the 20. Here comes the defense. Holy mother of mutant mayhem, he scored! And that, my friend, is the dance with someone who knows they can negotiate for more money next year. I call that shake, rattle, and bone. point attempt. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. That's a real buzzkill. He's running out of gas now. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. The kicker died on that play. Man, that's terrible. Now what do they do? Well, another player will assume the kicking role for the remainder of the game. And coach is praying he won't need a long field goal to win this one. It's first and ten. And that is caught for a first down. First down and nine. Man, about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. <laughs> Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Third and four. <laughs> He had it for a second there. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm, that's bleak, Bricks. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Pow! With the brain scrambler! calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. Second down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Nicely done for a first down. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. First down. He was.
is not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. He picks up eight yards on that pass. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And he just slipped away like a greased pig. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. Nice hit. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Grim, can I kill him? Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. And that's the end of the second quarter. Seven will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Damn. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Hot, Sorry, hot, partner. Hot, 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 hot. He is fighting for every... If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. You've got to catch that. Third down and six. Hot, hot one, three. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something.
something going here. And it's first and ten. He's not going down. Second down and long. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters then. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team. How have they not killed him yet? He's wearing a new mink coat, for God's sake. He's seven layers of smarmy, Grim. And this is the first, and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down and forever. And the defense jumps upside. It's not how many times you fall. It's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. <laughs> the offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, than the funeral expenses, that is. They're back up here on first down. Oh, ho, ho. that gets me every time. Like a jack in the box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is gonna blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. And it's first and 10. Runs it for four yards. Second down and six. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. 
The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Briggs. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one. Hot two. There aren't too many players that kids can look up to it. And that hit jars the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard hit. Welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Boy, he should be more careful when he hurdles. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, eight. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Second down and a lot. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Well, one yard is better than nothing, but not by much. Third down and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. That's the end of the third quarter. This game is going to come down to the wire. I love that show. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second down and five. He heard footsteps, so he tossed the ball out of bounds. Good move. Third down and five. And this guy's like a human cannonball. First down. And my next door neighbor was a human cannonball, Grim. He drowned in his pool. And it's first and ten. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. Seriously. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it.
And it's first and ten. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. Hot, hot one. Hot two, hot, hot, hot. The runner pulls out a chainsaw. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. They go to war speed dirty brick. He's so fast he watches 60 minutes and 60 seconds. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. Hey, kids, do you remember getting shoved in a locker because you wore glasses? I do. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Yeah, blue baby, I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Oh, Ooh. no. It's a sticky ball, dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball. Oh, with the brutal hit. wants to speed things up so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called that rabbit shit. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And that'll bring up third. Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock and he better win. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. Hot two, hot three. Running like a moose. That's a nice catch for five yards. Too little. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And that's how you get your buzz on in the NFL. And it's first and ten. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling them. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Hot one. That's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, it's all those power and green, like a high cool. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. That's a beautiful pass for the conversion. They'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. And that's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. Well, I want Sean Kick to make a kick like this with his ex. The mutant eaters devour the opposition and win the game. And let's hear what the game's MVP has to say. Yeah, right. Go home to your fans, cars, million-dollar mansions, and thoughts. And your beautiful trophy wives, you losers! At least they're not attached to a loser like me. All right, losers, let's hear what the game's MVP has to say. Oh, 
Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...